yes children in the fourth video we come across the previously the settlers speech of settlers chief settler is uh, trying to motivate his own people to rise and recognize your power remember what your ancestors have been though things were not part of your way but you must stand for your rights we continue reading a few more moons a few more windows a few more moons and a few more windows and not one of the descendants of the mighty horse that once moved over his bold land or lived in happy homes protected by the great spirits nobody is protected today we all are vulnerable for all types of uh, persecutions will remain to mourn over the graves of people once more powerful and hopeful than yours and we we say it's our fate we give to our destiny tribe follows tribe and nation follows nation like the waves of the sea we just continue what we have been doing like the white people is a directed as nation and they do as they are told and we do what we are told it is the order of nature and regret is useless the time of dk may be distant but it will surely come for on even the white man whose god walk and talk with them with him as friend to friend can be exempt from the common destiny we may be brothers after all we will see we all are brothers we are countrymen and everything but our rights and our the way we are being given all these things are when it looks we are all different we further we will ponder your proposition and when we decide we will let you know but should we accept it so he tells you are proposed give us i'll give you prosperity and everything and you just accept our terms and conditions he said should we i hear and now make this condition that we will not be denied the privilege without molestation of visiting at any time the tombs of our ancestors friends and children every part of this soil is sacred in the estimation of my people every hillside every valley every plain and grove has been hallowed by some sad or happy event in days long vanished all the place where we are staying is all sacred why is it sacred because the memories of our ancestors memories of all people memories of parents are still echoes there in the valleys in the caves and everywhere their memories is there though it is vanished it is disappeared but still it is there even the rocks which seem to be dumb and dead as they sweater in the sun along the silent shore shrill and memories of stirring events connected with the lives of may be even the places where these white people live all the stones and sand and everything which is which is a inanimate do not our lives still they proclaim the memories of our old people and were it dust upon which you know now stand responds more lovingly to their footsteps than yours because it is rich with the blood of our ancestors and our bare feet are conscious to the sympathetic touch so he tells even our forefathers who came before me they also had the views of mine they also tried a lot to improve the conditions of the people but seldom it happened because it was not many of the very of time many of one it was not in their hands. our departed braves found mothers glad happy hearted maidens and even the little children who lived here and rejoiced here for a brief season brief season will love this somber solitude and the event tide the great shadowy returning spirits you know people who lived in this area they all love to have lived in this region because they had their own contributions and when the last red man shall have perished and the memory of my tribe shall have become a myth along the white men these stones stones will swam the wind visible dead of my tribe and even when the children children's children think themselves alone in the field the store 
the shop upon the highway or in the silence of the pathless woods they will not be alone he is sympathetic the way the number has decreased from the ancient times the area in which they have been living decreased the number of people red indians there were many today it's very few if this this weight goes on in the coming year children and children's time it will be then vanish then the tribe will dis, uh, disintegrate and finish off it will they will be vanish from this land whom shall we blame the reason for this solitude reason for the isolation the reason for everything is is we we are not stood to our expectation of our generation at night when the streets of our cities and villages are silent and we think them deserted they will strong with the returning hosts that fill once filled them and still love is beautiful land the white man will never be alone but this white people don't take that we will be there at least in a small number we will be there it will not be the land of white at all but it's our strong faith that we must remain we must proclaim our ancestor traditions the place where we live let him be just and let him be just and deal kindly let him be just and deal kindly with my people for the dead are not powerless that did i say there is no death only a change of worlds very powerful words of a settler who in spirit which is very much inspirational motivational to this tribal people who were in once upon a time was what much more larger they uh, control much more greater things and now how they fall prey to the disintegration and due to the very due to the uh, the behavior due to the system they have been pushed into a uh, smaller areas and they say let him be just and deal kindly with my people for the dead are not powerless that did i say there is not that only change of words chief satan version 1 which appeared in the satel sunday star on october 29 1887 in the column by dr henry a smith so yes children we uh will have to uh, wind up this and uh, video sessions and kindly go through these chapters thoroughly that you may have no issues in reading the chapter the literature is this words and are much, much familiar words and kind uh, so therefore most of these words can be easily uh, understood so see you take care stay blessed stay inside